Exodus 13, verses 20 to 22. And they moved on from Sukkoth and encamped at Etham, on the edge of the wilderness. And the Lord went before them by day in a pillar of cloud to lead them along the way, and by night in a pillar of fire to give them light, that they might travel by day and by night. The pillar of cloud by day and the pillar of fire by night did not depart from before the people. What a loving father. He certainly keeps his promise. He promised that he would never leave us alone. And when we look at the scripture, we see that God was with them by day and by night. In other words, even though fortunes will change, even though you will go through different seasons, even though things will not always be the same, there is one constant that you can depend on. God will be with you. As long as you operate according to his will, as long as you submit to his way, he will not leave you. Actually, interestingly, even when Israel went out of line, even when they had their rebellious moments, even when they were murmuring and complaining, he never left them. He was with them day and night. Another great thing I've noticed is that he was to them whatever they needed. And so, in the day, he was a pillar of cloud leading them, which of course, would also provide some shade from the heat of the sun, the direct glare of the sun. But at night, he was not a pillar of cloud, but a pillar of fire, so that they would have the light that they needed at the night time. He is indeed the I am. He is whatever we have need of. He is not limited by our circumstances, but he will become what we need whenever we need it. What an awesome God we serve. I also noticed that his presence is not manifested in the same way all the time. Sometimes we miss the move of God and we, we miss the presence of God because we are stuck on our past experiences and we limit God to our past experiences. But do you remember he said that his ways are past finding out? Yes, he will operate differently at different times. His presence will manifest in different ways, at different times, depending on the particular needs. And so, let us seek to have that relationship with God so that we can be sensitive to the move of the Spirit, so we can discern the Spirit, knowing that He will not always manifest in the same way, but He will always be there and in the way that we need him. God bless you. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. And for more, please visit us on a Sunday morning at 9 a.m. at 10 Union Square, Crossroads, Kingston, Jamaica. If you can't be there in person, join us virtually as we stream live on Facebook. See you soon.